Hello everyone, um, this vlog is kind of special because it contains, it's like, let me explain the title of the video. It's like, I'm gonna have a vlog from recent, like maybe like two weeks ago, a vlog from 2021, and then a vlog from 2020. Um, because I recorded some vlogs before that I never like edited or posted. So that's what this is, this is a little time capsule, a little like time travel moment, and yeah. Hope you guys enjoy. I'm gonna incorporate a little bit of like illustration for the third vlog because there's like less footage for that one. So I'm gonna have to like spice it up a little bit. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Also, major, major cringe warning for everyone. I was such a a character back then. Y'all will see, but like, <laughs> yeah, just putting that out there. Hello, residents of Ali Island. Um, it has been ages since I vlogged and I'm so sorry for that. I literally just like have been busy and then didn't find the courage to do it. But today I'm going to London again. I feel like most of these vlogs are just me going to London, honestly. Um, we need to do a home-based vlog soon. Um, but yeah, I'm going to London to see some friends and I'm going to Greenwich Park for the first time, which has like an amazing view from what I've seen online. So yeah, hoping to, hoping to see that, I guess. Spoiler alert, we didn't see it. And yeah, today's fit inspired by Alex G or Alex G fans, you know, you get the vibe. I'm gonna crack a rib. Bye. <laughs> okay, I've left and I'm currently listening to, um. Into Deep by I forgot what the I forgot what the artist is called. Some forty one. The band is some forty one. But yeah, that's what's happening. Kind of pretty today, no? So there was some kind of game going on, and so it was just like an influx of people trying to get on and off the train. Hence that big crowd. But eventually I got on, and now I'm on my way. Um, I made it. I forgot to. The video cut off, but I meant to say I forgot to vlog me coming off the train. I am going the wrong way, by the way. I totally am going the wrong way. So I'm gonna pretend to take a photo. And now we circle back. I don't remember if I told y'all the plan, but it was... I come to Waterloo slash London Eye, and I meet my friend here. And then both me and him make our way to... To Greenwich, I think. Um, yeah. Everyone that's in today's video has been featured in a previous video already, so. That's a lie. We had a special guest, Adrian, join us for today's vlog. I tried to pay, he begged me to stay. Babe, I'm not staying, I just want to play. Yeah, he said to meet at the Eye, which is right there. And now, uh, he should be coming from that way. I got too shy to vlog me meeting them, but we made it. We're on our way. Um, here's us on the tube. Hold it on for dear freaking life. And yeah. <laughs> I thought it was on like a big hill. Big hill. It's a really big park. Oh, Aren't all parks big? You know what? He ate that question right up. <laughs> pop, 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 pop. Bye -bye. I thought you lost your license. Oh, yeah. Okay, we left the park. How was your park trip, Zawiya? How was it? It was good. Yeah, what was your favorite part? Um, the alcohol. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. Okay. What was your favorite part? Um, my favorite part was sitting with you guys and having lots of fun little conversations. Oh, yours was like nice and mine was kind of shallow. No, it was it was like sweet. <laughs> it was sweet. <laughs> Are the escalators on? Bye bye. Bye. You were mine. If only you were mine. Baby, I'm thugging. I can't be your boyfriend. If only you were mine. If only you were mine. Maybe I could be, but I don't know if I should. 
but why are my eyes so red? Yeah, it's really nice. Evan, where are we? Where are we going right now? Uh, Liverpool Street Station. For what? Vintage stores. Yes. Are you excited? Yeah. Gonna buy something. What? Oh, uh, there's like multiple. I don't know which ones. Just like. What's Brooklyn? Brooklyn. It's by my school. I'll direct. I know where I'm going. Oh, it's so bad. That's like a full on dread. You got a locks up. Like a mat? Like a dread. That's a dread. I got that 4C air. No, it's, it's supposed to be bouncy. Like, oh, this one's a dread as well. We should go on one of those. Goodbye, Canary War. Oh. This fucking water is dirty. Really? <sighs> <laughs> Zaria got trapped in a sewer, so now we're on our way to go rescue her. <laughs> like, she's trapped! Ooh! It's in the wall, that's good. I'm looking in the diamond. This place goes out such a vintage vibes, bro. <laughs> I said it all like, I'm looking at like, dog, I love your, your vintage Carhartt t shirt, yeah? I Where love you your vintage to? Adidas. Oh my god, is that Supreme? Oh my god, show the phone case. So Ayo! Ayo! Who the fuck is she? We're at the vintage stores and all the good stuff. Well, it's in London. A vintage store plus being in London, overpriced. 26 pounds. Rate your 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 vintage experience on a scale of one to ten. I'd say four out of ten because I didn't really find anything I liked. We uh, went so late. We went so late. Everything's closing. Do you shop vintage, Gabby? Rarely, but I like a good vintage. I love Fine. vintage. Right. Look at his fit. Vintage. It's not vintage, but it's like vintage warrior. Vintage styled. Never gonna get. Never gonna get. Look at him. Put on the headphones. Put, put them on. Put them on. I dare you. Put on the headphones. Go on. Put them on. I'm my battery. Oh, okay. Sure. Sure. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Bye, Evan. Peace. <laughs> uh, goodbye, London. Goodbye. Get me out of here. Um, the next train is in 14. Like the next train period, and also my train is in 14. So. I <laughs> Good morning, except it's 2.30, so I kind of just got out of bed. Welcome to my vlog. <laughs> I look so... Ah! Let's make breakfast. And then try to not look like a zombie today. I ordered the panda version of this, and it's supposed to come tomorrow, because, um... My friend who dyed his hair orange freaking stole it. Oh, it's gone. Never mind. You better work that lazy eye. <laughs> Guys, I'm so sorry, but I'm gonna have to pause until I'm out the shower, have an outfit on. I just look. <laughs> I said I'd be back after like an hour or so. It's been like. <laughs> Three hours. <laughs> Only three hours? Wait. Um, made breakfast. <laughs> Showered, shaved, did my hair, and now I'm here. 
Ah, uh, that was kind of a wrap. That was kind of a wrap. Anyways, it's dark outside now. I thought about being freaking loud outside. So I don't know what to say. Don't know what to do either. Um, this was kind of dark. Oh. <laughs> Should I go get a coffee? A free coffee? One second. I think I have to pull in Abby Lee Miller and ditch the ditch the venue to go get Baskin Robbins. Maybe not. Maybe not. Baskin Robbins. McDonald's. It's seven degrees. Ah! I don't know. Um. No. Don't worry. I'm not going to McDonald's. I'm going to tortilla instead. <laughs> It's like cold, but not like I'm dying cold probably because I'm like layered up, but it's like an interesting cold, you know, it's like an interesting cold. After her controversy. Hi vlog. I recommend eating a burrito with like a carbonated drink. Specifically Peach Monster. I'm not sponsored, but I should be. Um, it's like seven degrees, but we out here. Where is she? She's still taking freaking picture of the lights. Where are they? Serving New York Christmas, New York Home Alone. I forgot I was in public and that people were looking. Too bad, I'm giving them a show. <laughs> Is that the one with the gingerbread man? The big one? Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Anyways, my controversial take. Shrek 2 is a really good movie. That's not even controversial, it's just facts at this point. Um, what did that one girl say? Well, she was like, I have freedom of speech and everything I'm saying is true. Something. There's nothing wrong with my views or beliefs because I have freedom of speech and everything I'm saying is true. Something, I don't remember. I have to charge my crystal. Hi. Hi. I'm back. Um, <clears throat> I'm. Do you want to see what my setup to set the camera up is? Freaking water bottle on a laptop. Let's see if this even stays. Oh, that's not a cute angle. I'm so sorry. That's not a cute angle. I'm just gonna have to hold the phone. Hi. I'm back. Um, went. I literally just went to tortilla and drank that freaking peach monster. So good. I have to do some work because I had like a week to do it, and when did I leave it for? Last minute. <laughs> Sorry, um, I don't know, I don't know what to do now. Let me do some more, let me do some more. <laughs> you see, that is so embarrassing because I filmed an outro and it didn't freaking save. So this is the new outro, which is literally a day later. I was trying to freaking say that I finished my work and I just forgot to record. It was literally me in my bed at like two in the morning being like, I finished my work guys. Thank you for enjoying the video. But like I'm completely over it now. Like the hype is done. Um, thanks for watching if you got this far. There might be new stuff coming maybe, depending on how I feel. Low key, there will be new stuff. You just like to lie, like, and I was gonna say shout out to Axel for making me want to be famous. So, yeah. Also, look at the lighting. Um, and yeah, that's all I have to say. And didn't I do it for you? Why don't I? Ooh. Hi, y'all. <laughs> Today I'm getting ready for school. Today, I'm getting ready for school. It's six in the morning. Let's go. Okay, so I showered and I'm putting on the shirt. I'm not allowed to show the school logo, pretty sure, so that I don't get sued. But this is supposed to be a get ready with me story time. Problem is that I don't know what story to tell. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now I have to go make breakfast. But my brother's sleeping outside. So I'm gonna be quiet and I'm gonna put some some music in the back. This one is for the boys with the booming system. Top count AC with the cooling system. When you come up in the club, he be blazing up. That sex on deck, but he's blazing up. And he's ill, he will, he might got a deal. He pop bottles and he got the right kind of bill. He tell, he tell, he might tell. He always in the air, but he never right. On pay. Um, 
I have a test today, but here's the issue. I don't know a single thing from that class. Yep, yep. So, I guess I'll just... <gasps> You know, it'd be a cute idea if I got to school and then told the story there. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, it is. You want to be my video? Yes. Hi. She interrupted my story time. <laughs> All right, now that I'm in school. You see lockers. Anyways, um, story time. So this happened in like, when I was in grade five for American people and grade six for UK people. Um, basically what happened was like, it, we were at recess and we were going back to the classroom and what they do is they make us line up on like the, the basketball court and then we go like um, grade by grade back to our classes on oh, my acne. Anyways. So when we were walking back there, we saw the basketball court fall. Not the basketball court, the basketball hoop thingy, you know? The basketball court hoop fell. And obviously if there's children lined up on the court, what do you think happened? That's right, it fell on someone. It fell on someone. It fell on like a grade two, year three. It fell on someone's head and it cut open their head. It cut open their head and they were bleeding. They were bleeding all over the court and their children were like, ah! You know, because like, being in primary school and seeing blood spill on the court from someone's open head, what do you think? What do you think? I'm gonna, I would be traumatized as well. So there were like children screaming and it was like a whole predicament and I just couldn't. No one couldn't really. And like, it took so long for a teacher to get there and find out and it was like, hello. So anyways. So yeah, they cut, the, the child's head was cut open and it took so long for a teacher to get there. And when the teacher did get there, um, the child, you know what they did? Dad came and put an ice pack on it. It was like, there, 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 there. Thinking about it now, maybe he was just calming his son down before the ambulance got there. Like, I was so, uh. So I'm pretty sure that kid is like traumatized or like something because a basketball hoop. Um, anyway, so yeah, and then it started raining and it washed the blood off the court. It was kind of, kind of convenient, you know, but yeah, we were all like, oh no, it's poor thing. And then we stopped caring like five minutes after it happened. We hate primary school. That's the story portion. Um, and the get ready with me portion. So I guess that's the end. That's the end. Let me do a little dance for you real quick. <laughs>